this is Greg Pitts. Um, I'm at the Grove Ret Retrospective here in um, Coconut Grove preparing for um, my show for Miami Art Basel oh, and just yeah, election yeah. that's shown here exclusively at Grove Retrospective in um, 2011. It's my 2012 collection, but it can only be seen here first. So yeah, if you want to see this, sneak you peek. must come to Grove Retrospective here in Coconut Grove on Grand Avenue. And um, so come see me. Yeah, come. And um, if I'm not here, Steve's here. You can give me a call, and I'll come and show up. Okay? Cool. Bye. Okay, now, folks. Most people say, well, Greg, why did you pick this particular gallery to show at during Miami Art Basel? This is why. My work is hanging in a gallery where you have Warhol, Dolly, Leichtenstein, Wasserman, Johns, Dine, Picasso, oh Tomeo, Rivers, Sultan, Mata, Miro, Oldenburg, Davis, Young, Rupert Smith. So I can say there's art in here that's five to six digits and the black Jackson Polly. And showing. I am a living artist <laughs> and my stuff a is hanging legend, here. My legend. art is not the cookie cutter stuff you that you come. see Original. everywhere. Yeah, okay? authentic. So come, come check us out. Yeah. All right, goodbye. <laughs> We're not even inside yet. From the window, look at that. Isn't that beautiful? What does that say? Gregory Pitts. The table. Painted glass is mine. The huge piece there with the canvas that was stretched, the other glass piece on the right hand side. All those six pieces right there. One, two, three, four, five, six. Wow. I had to build my canvases. I wrap them myself and um, they can be shipped all over the world. Cracked. Uh -huh. So they gave it to me. I didn't take the crack out. I just went ahead and re reinvented it. Right. Oh, wow. This is a screen yes. right here. I think this is a screen from like a drawer or a little oven or uh -huh. something that somebody uh -huh. gave me. And I reinvented it and put it over, it over the guy's mouth. So this, at this particular moment, I'm putting that up there, you know, and I'm excited. It's like, you know, I'm overwhelmed because everybody is always like right here. They're right here all the time, all the time. And so I'm like, okay, <clears throat> enough already. So then you see the red, enough already. And so I put that grill there as a as a protection of my being and my protecting my creativity. And that's what that depicts. Um, oh, there's the yeah. yeah, the lighting, I have to kind of adjust the lighting a little bit. But you're an artist, so you can see it. That's hysterical. So cool, how do you do that? Yeah, this is for real. You know how people, you know, you have a certain thought process is always that one person is like, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. It's like, oh, yeah. So, and I work all the time.
There she goes, Lamar. Wow. You know what? We are from the same hometown in Ohio. A little teeny town, and we're meeting for the first this time. This is history, guys. This is your boy, producer, Greg Pitts of Lamar Pitts TV. I'm going to tell you something. This is a surreal moment. Me and Karen are from the same area in Lyme, Ohio, and we are the best artists in the world. See, Ohio, you didn't know what you were producing, <laughs> but we do. We do. <laughs> <laughs> Good. Oh my God! This is my this is my producer Lamar of Lamar Fish TV. <laughs> Hello. 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 Wow. Wow. <laughs> it is Lima, Ohio. This is producer Greg Pitts of Lamar Pitts really? TV <laughs> with my friend Karen Jones. Now, we come from the same area in a small town, again, named Lyme, Ohio. So what we're going to do is I'm going to give her 30 seconds to kind of talk about her experience and how we met and all these beautiful things. I'm out of frame. We met on Twitter. <laughs> <laughs> Did wow. we meet on Twitter? Yes, yeah, what we yeah, met. That's very and this was the one right here, the bow tie, is the one I saw. Wow. Wow. You actually helped me with the bow tie. I did a lot of um, searching for my bow, the bow tie. Right, right. Isn't this beautiful? Wow. So Ohio, you need to recognize, we need to be in a museum together, side by side, in yeah. Ohio, yeah. Lima, Ohio. <laughs> look what you produced. Yeah. And I'm just a little boy from the hood, but look at me now. <laughs> look at, look me, at me, me now. Take a look. Take a look. Take a look. Take a look. This, this will complete my evening. Greg Pitts, producer, Lamar Pitts TV, with my friend James Eccles from the Soul of Miami and Annette Baker from Soul of Miami. We just need 30 seconds to ask you how your experience have been for this festive week for Miami Art Basel, being that you've been instrumental in years with Soul of Miami and giving new artists the opportunity to show their work. Mr. James Eccles. It's been great, you know, it's a, it's a really exciting year this year. There's a lot of new exhibitions and a lot of new artists. You see a lot more local work out. And it's been a really, really good year. So that's, wow. good, for the, that's good for the family. Wow, yeah. cool. Good. cool. That's good, thanks a lot. That was James Eccles, Soul of Miami, one of the first gentlemen who gave me <laughs> my um, opportunity to do some shows with him a while back. And um, James, he knows I appreciate him all the time. Great guy, Soul of Miami. Uh, Nick, can you say something for us real quick? This has been an awesome art basel. This has been an awesome art basel. The, I think the artwork this year has been better than the last several years. And it has been just fantastic. The, the vibe has wow. been so much higher wow. and friendlier than it has in the past couple of years. So I've really, really enjoyed it and looking forward to next year. Wow. Thank you. Thank you, Annette. Thank you.